Hello children! In this video, we will learn about human body. Our body has many parts and it is like a living machine. Each part has a name and have different functions. Children, now let's look at some of our body parts. This is head. My head has a lot of hair. This is my forehead. These are my eyes and they help me to see everything. This is my nose. It helps me to breathe and smell. These are my ears. They help me to hear different types of sounds. This is my cheek and this is my chin. This is my mouth. I eat food and speak from my mouth. These are my lips, these are my teeth, and this is my tongue. This is my neck, it helps me to turn my head. This is my shoulder, it helps me to carry my school bag. This is my chest, and this is my stomach. This is my arm, and this is my elbow. These are my hands. These are my fingers and this is my thumb. We use our hands, fingers, thumbs and elbows to pull, push, pat, scoop, carry, lift, throw and hold different things. It also helps us to write, draw, paint, play musical instruments and eat. This is my leg, this is my knee, this is my foot and these are my toes. My legs help me to stand, walk, run, kick, jump and skip. Let's revise some of the body parts and their functions. Eyes helps us to see, ears helps us to hear. Nose helps us to smell and breathe. Mouth helps us to speak and eat. Hand helps us to pull, push, carry, lift, throw or hold different things. Legs helps us to stand, walk, run, kick, jump and skip. We should take care of the different parts of our body to keep them in good condition. It's quiz time! I will ask you a question and I will give you three options. You have to guess the correct answer. Are you ready? My first question is, which is not a part of our body? Hand Pencil, leg. Yes, you're right. Pencil is not a part of our body. The next question is, if your hands are tied behind, you will not be able to hold books, run, speak. Excellent! You won't be able to hold books if your hands are tied behind you. If your legs are tied to a chair, you will not be able to speak, eat, walk. Good job! If your legs are tied to a chair, you will not be able to Walk. A child in your class cannot see. What will you do? Help him. Laugh at him. Ignore him. Well done. If a child in your class cannot see, then you should help him. We walk with our neck, legs, hands. Good 
job. We walk with our legs. We carry a school bag on our ears, shoulders, stomach. Very good. We carry a school bag on our shoulders. How many eyes and nose do we have? Two eyes and two nose. One eye and one nose. Two eyes and one nose. That's right. We have two eyes and one nose. Thanks for watching. See you next time.